Okay, this is how I use the Visco VSCO app. This is the easy peasy way. So you go in and at the bottom, you see those little squares. So you want to make sure you're on those two little squares and then you click plus at the top right. Then you pick an image and you click import. Once it's imported in the app, you click on the image and at the bottom, you will see the two little lines that says edit. So you click on edit. And then for this photo, you'll see some different suggestion from the app for um, this photo. Or you can go with, if you look on top, you have all presets, you have your favorites. Basically, it's a collection of, it's a collection of filters. So you can look, um, you can save your favorites and then your most recent ones that you've used and you want to use some, some sort of a consistency so your feed um, looks nice and your photos have some kind of a flow to them so if you go so say i say okay there's another one that says for this photo and then the featured from um from the app so ka3 is a really cool one and this is kind of a, the kodak series and i like it so i like to not put it too too strong because it gets a bit over the top this is what's shot in portrait by the way it's really neat so i say okay this and then you can adjust the contrast i'm not gonna put too too much contrast because it already um, has some exposure we give it a little tiny bit of brightness but and then so this so you keep on going you can go sharpen you can adjust for different formats depending of what where you want to post it but you can also i mean use that in the um as is so you can play with this these are kind of your more stories uh functions and then say i say okay I'm, i want this like that and then you click next and you save it to your camera roll and then you will be able to go to your camera roll and use your photo as you see fit. Make sure to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Bye.